if you know what consciousness is, then this consciousness is something which is occurring in the mind. It is the foundation of the mind. But the true self or the real self, uh, for that, you know, in Sanskrit we have a word called Chaitanya. And for consciousness we have a word in Sanskrit called Chaitanyata. And most of the times, uh, people are very confused about that is it two things or is it just one thing? Um, but it surely has very different connotations to it. When we say Chaitanya, so if I translate this word in English, then it would be conscious. And if I translate word consciousness into Hindi or Sanskrit, then it becomes Chaitanyata. Now these are two different things. It's not just one, number one. Like the sun is far, far away from the earth. But what we receive on the earth are the, the rays of the sun. The whole sun has not come to the earth. <clears throat> when we say the sun has risen, it's just a myth. Sun never rises. When we, when we say that sun has set, it's again a myth, sun never sets. Sun is always shining in, in, the, in the galaxy. Is that earth is moving and hence when we are um, not facing the sun, we don't have the day, we don't have the light and we have very, very dark night. So Chaitanya is like the rays of the conscious. So it is sometimes there and it is sometimes not there. Like in the waking state, the Chaitanya, the consciousness is functioning, so is it functioning in the dream state, but it's like in a subdued veil of darkness is there in the third stage of the consciousness, and that is what we call the Sushupti in Sanskrit, and in English it will be uh, the deep sleep. So the, the consciousness moves from waking to dream to deep sleep, it keeps on moving into these three, but the pure self is the conscious being, and that is not going into a state and not transferring or transmigrating from state to state to state. So again, the problem of the English language is that most of the authors, most of the writers have written that everything is consciousness, and everything has come out of consciousness. And then they say, okay, rise your consciousness. Now it is very dirty and sullied and you need to work to rise your consciousness. Now it is like the consciousness, meaning the Chaitanyata. So if you are talking about Chaitanyata, then you are not talking about the Atman. There's a two different things. Like sun and the rays of the sun are two different things. Although they are one, but still, a ray is not a sun, and sun is just not few rays which are, you know, which we see in a daylight. Mm -hmm.